Some photos may seem innocent enough, but once you know the backstory, you may find them truly disturbing. An atomic bomb was dropped on Hiroshima in August 1945, vaporising the city in its wake. Left behind were the radiation shadows of its victims, the only images left of their final moments of life. It looks like an innocent looking photo of John Lennon signing an autograph for a fan, yet the man with the legendary singer was Mark Chapman. A few hours after the photo was taken, a truly disturbed Chapman shot Lennon dead. In 1999, three weeks before the Columbine High School shooting, classmates gathered for a photo. The shooters, Eric Harris and Dylan Claybold, can be seen in the top left corner in a truly disturbing threat of what was to come. The innocence of a child. Two ten-year-old boys spot their victim at a shopping centre and two-year-old James Bolger blindly took the hand of one of his killers as the other boy led the way. The two boys took the toddler to a train line where they murdered him. Blanche Monnier was held hostage by her mother in France for 24 years. When she was rescued by police, they bribed the truly disturbed sight of the naked and half-starved woman who was living amongst her own filth. The reason for her incarceration? She had fallen in love with an older man. In 2014, Brendan Vega and Sailor Gillian had gone hiking in Montecito when they both fell and were injured. Brendan tried to go for help, yet tragically fell to his death. The following day, hikers were taking photos and later realised that they had photographed Sailor. Sailor was rescued alive, but badly injured. Dean Call was a serial killer who murdered almost 30 boys between 1970 and 1973. Amongst the photos of victims was a truly disturbing photo of a young boy. Handcuffed and terrified, the boy looks up at his killer. To this day, he remains unidentified. <laughs>